So in this video, I'm going to talk about level three BTEC IT um, and how you can do well in it. I did level three BTEC IT. I got a distinction which is equivalent to an A. Um, if you're trying to get into uni, you, you know it's just helpful. Um, so it'll be separated into two parts. You've got unit one and unit two. I think unit one is the sitting exam where you've got a bunch of material you need to go through, like storage devices, cloud, and you know cloud computing, cloud storage, and then so on. It'll be about uh, IT devices, right? Anyways, for that part, for unit one, get a textbook get the textbook i'll put a screenshot on the screen and i'll link it in the description as well it goes through everything so all the material you will need to know about will be on that textbook so i'll pretty much just go through the textbook write notes and if you need to watch videos or you learn better through videos check out my channel and then you can also check out the guy's page i'm not sure if he does unit one but um check that guy's page out as well um unit two or the database one you've got it's on microsoft, microsoft access isn't it so you've got relational databases um, go through the material. On the in the notebook, you've got the database section and the IT section. Um, on the database section, it goes through lab sessions, which pretty much goes through all the functionalities of Microsoft Access. So if you want to do well on Unit One and Two, just get that notebook or textbook. It's going to set you back 10, 20 quid max, but it's helpful. Um, everything's on there. Um, that's pretty much it. Unit One. So pretty much Unit One. Go through the textbook, write notes, and watch videos either my videos or that guy's videos and then unit two watch that guy's videos he goes through past paper questions and then again look through the notebook go through the lab sessions um it shows you how to do stuff like how microsoft access works and then pretty much in that exam they're looking for you they're looking to, for you to show them that you know how relational databases work and that you can connect to different tables and then i think there's like queries that you need to do right um sql i mean yeah it comes up but you don't really you don't really need to know sql you can do without um so yeah, that's pretty much it. There isn't much to it. Cool. If you have any questions, again, let me know. You know, ask them in the comments. But there isn't too much to know. The costs are pretty easy. You just need to revise. <laughs> like that's it.